previously on Math Ends On with Python. Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Ends On with Python and today we are going to learn on how we can perform the multivariate analysis of variance. So like ANOVA, the multivariate analysis of variance is designed to test the significance of the group's differences. But MANOVA includes more than one dependent variable, which is basically continuous. Like ANOVA, MANOVA has both uh, one-way and two-way MANOVA. And therefore, in this tutorial, we are going to learn on how you can perform the multivariate analysis of variance using Python. So uh, we have the data set, as you can see. Uh, these are the data set for countries, okay, showing the uh, per capita income. Uh, infant mortality rate and this country are from different regions and also this status here is whether that country is oil uh, exporting or not so therefore we are going to use those data as our sample data in elaborating or illustrating how we can perform the multivariate analysis of variance so we have the libraries here I have the pandas as PD, I have the uh, start modes, the ordinary list square methods, and uh, also we have the main library for today, which is MANOVA, and the uh, 2K HSD for group comparison. So uh, we have already loaded the data. My data is if mod. Uh, you can see the name of the data file. Okay. And we have cleaned the data uh, using the drop a function. So let's start uh, forming the multivariate analysis. Basically, I'm going to uh, use the one-way multivariate analysis where we are going to include one independent variable. So let's call the function for multivariate analysis. That is, we label it as multivariate analysis of variance equal to manova dot from in the score formula we are going to write inside the formula for what we are going to examine and we are going to examine the uh, group difference in income and infant mortality across regions so what we do is the income and infant mortality rate in relation to region and this should take the data from df data frame and then let's print this analysis we command the print of this multivariate analysis of variance dot mv underscore test this is the function okay and let's print this one and see the output. So we have the output here for the multivariate analysis of analysis between the dependent variable income and infant mortality uh, in relation to region. Okay. So you can see here the intercept is quite okay. Okay. It's prohibited. Uh, its p value is less than the level of significance which is basically a 0, uh, 0.05 or is a 5% level of significant. So uh, in this analysis, I'm going to use the Wilkes Lambda as the test statistics for this multivariate analysis. But remember, the Wilkes Lambda statistics is used if full homogeneity of the variance covariance is assumed. So I assume the variance covariance is, is okay here. And now you can see the Wills lambda for the region, which is the independent variable, its p value is quite significant. Okay, so uh, we can say that the p value for the Wills lambda, as you can see, is less than 5% as a reference level of significant, and therefore. The region here is significantly differ, okay, for the combined uh, this 
in the uh, dependent variables. Now, since the Wilkes lambda for region have shown the significance difference for income and infant mortality rate uh, between uh, different regions, then we can't stop here uh, except we have to go further because this one have shown the combined uh, e effects, okay? So what we need is now to perform the univariate analysis for each dependent variable, okay? We are going to uh, check the ANOVA for the income and region to examine the mean difference in income be existing between regions since the region is significant then we have to go to the next step for income we have to develop a model so we can use it in the analysis of variance and uh, this model will be solved by OLS and we are going to test the uh, income in relation to region okay and we have to take the data from df and then put fit so the multivariate i mean the analysis of variance now for this univariate is equal to sm dot starts dot anova linear model we have the regression model and we are going to use type 2 okay so let's command the print analysis of variance okay so i'm going to print this one and see so you can see the analysis of variance for region here its p value is still very small to the overall p value but in multivariate analysis also I want to caution something. After performing the multivariate analysis of variance, okay, using the level of significance, whatever you have chosen, either 5% or 10%, in the univariate analysis of variance, you have to take the overall level of significance. For instance, here I used 5%. You divide by number of dependent variables in the model and then that level of significance obtained will be used as a point of reference okay for the levels of significance for each univariate analysis why are we doing that is because we would we want to avoid the type 1 error okay if you proceed using the overall level of significance you will quite develop uh, a type 1 error okay so in this analysis of multivariate analysis we are going to use 0.025 as a, a reference level of significance because we have two dependent variable and that 5% divided by 2, you'll have 0.025. So still you can compare with this uh, p-value here, you can see that still region is less than that. Therefore, it indicates that there is a significant mean difference in income, okay, per capita income, between regions so therefore uh, we can't stop here we need to know specifically which regions have shown that significant difference okay because this is a general there is a significant mean difference in income between region but which regions are those then we have to perform the multiple comparison test which is post hoc uh, analysis test so the post hoc here we are going to have multiple comparison equal to pairwise underscore 2k hsd and here inside we have to write the dependent variable and the dependent variable from the data frame is the income okay and the independent variable here is the region okay so you can specify the level of significance for this we are going to use the alpha which is the 0 0.025 okay and then we are done so let's expand this one let's see how 
our function that is our function and then let's command the printout so we print the multiple comparison so we have that one and then let's print so we have the output here and you can see the output we have the rejection status so we have three groups okay the first one second one is here and the third one is here with the rejection status uh, of true that means uh, this one have rejected the null hypothesis that uh, there is no significance difference so it rejected the null hypothesis so it shows that there is a significance difference in mean income existing between africa and europe okay and existing between america and europe and asia and europe therefore this is how you now you can perform the multiple analysis step by step thank you for watching i did this for a one-way multivariate analysis of variance but uh, i'm going to conduct a next video which i'll show you the two-way multivariate analysis of variance Thank you and goodbye.